I'm not sure if the fuck is lighter here. No service. What a surprise. Can't you guys slow down a little? It's hard enough to see where you're going. <gasps> what the? It's a dead end. There's no exit. It keeps getting creepier and creepier the further we go. <sighs> I can't hold it any longer. My bladder's gonna explode. Yosuke, what are you doing? I gotta let it out before I piss my pants. In other words, imagine they would be all on shrooms right now, similar to you in Far Cry 3 when you begin the game. Imagine that for a moment. And this is in fact Juness. Okay, imagine that as well. This is a Juness. They're just on drugs and they don't know they're inside of Juness. And now they piss some customers. Like, <laughs> like oh, they are literally pissing off customers right now. Yep. Turn around, I can't go if everyone's watching. Yeah, I imagine you're pissing off some <laughs> fucking customers. I can't do it. It's all your fault if my bladder bursts. Like I care. No, asshole. Anyways, what's with this room? Check out these posters. Their faces are all cut out. Somebody must really hate this person. Dude, this chair and rope, that kind of arrangement is never good. It's tied in a noose. Is this a scarf? Huh. Come on, let's go back to where we came from and, and look somewhere else for an exit. Hey, I think I've seen that poster before. Who cares? Let's go. I am sick of this place. And I'm not feeling so good. Now that you mention it, me too. All right, let's go back. I'm seriously starting to feel sick. Similar to Persona 3, no, just the fact that you never get sick in this game, except if you eat rotten food and you're just okay if you just go to sleep. Good, isn't it? Whew. We finally made it back here. Wait, what's that? There's something over there. Hello. It looks like... I, I'm not sure, an egg with a spike on his head. Okay, it's a teddy. Oh, it's teddy, yeah. Hi, that's teddy. What is this thing? A, a monkey? A bear? What in the world? That's what I want to know. Who are you guys? Mysterious <gasps> beer. It talked! Uh, what are you? You, you want to fight? No, don't yell at me like that. Okay. What is this place? Yeah, that sounds okay. This place is what it is. It doesn't have a name. It's where I live. You empty fucking shitheads. Live here? If I was you guys, I'd hurry back to the other side. Someone's been throwing people in here. It's a big headache. Huh? Throwing people in? What are you talking about? I don't know who's doing it. I just want them to think before they go doing things like that. Hey, what's your problem? What gives you the right to yell at us like that? What are you? Where are we? What the heck's going on here? I already told you. Anyways, you should hurry back. What it comes down to is... You want us to get out of here, right? Well, so do we. We just don't know how, Dick. Ah, that's why I'm saying I'll let you out. Like I keep saying, we don't know where the frickin' exit... Wait, what? What the hell? Well, where did these TVs come from? Okay, now go, go, get out 
here. I'm a busy bear. What's going on now? Whoa! Hey, what, what are you doing? S stop pushing! Yay. I just decided to make on the very first episode, just let me click a little opening, like the opening of an anime because I like it. The first one. Huh? Is this... Did we make it back? No, you didn't. Teddy made it. Yeah, Teddy. That's actually his name. He is Teddy. Attention shoppers. Our is that a penguin? Time sale will now begin at look the above the TV. On the first floor. Above the TV, there's a penguin, isn't it? Look at look exactly. It's a penguin, isn't it? Yeah, it's a penguin. It's so Why a penguin. Try the delicious fresh produce Juness picked for you this morning as your side dish for dinner tonight. Because fuck you. All ages are invited to take advantage of this incredible bargain. Crap! It's already that late. <sighs> Looks like we were in there for quite a while. That's right. Now I remember where I saw that poster before. Oh, really? Over there. That's the poster we saw. What's up now? Hey, you're right. They're the same. I, I couldn't tell before without the face, but it was Miss Suzu Hiragi. She's been all over the news lately. Something about her husband having an affair with that announcer lady who died yeah, the other day. Yeah, it makes sense for you if you if you guys now turn on your head, you know that this makes sense. That this was the room where she committed suicide in. Hey, so does that mean that weird room we saw? Could it be related to that Yamano lady's death? Yes, it is. Believe it or not. I think about it. There was that creepy noose hanging from the ceiling. Yeah, stop. No more. We got to stop talking about this. I'm going to wipe what happened today from my brain. I don't think my poor heart can take any more. You should rather go to the car toilet. I'm feeling a chill too. Let's go home. I want to lie down and rest. Hey, welcome home. What are they eating? Looks like big ramen bowls. It's actually big ramen bowls, I'm pretty sure about that. Um, well, I doubt you'd know. But have you heard anything about a student named Saki Konishi? Uh, she wasn't at school today. Oh, I see. Well, to be honest, we got a call from her family. She's disappeared. Mm, I got food. So, she disappeared, okay. We've got people looking for her, but she hasn't been found yet. Okay. <sighs> Work just keeps piling up. And now, more on the case still casting a shadow over the foggy town of Inaba. Not long ago, television announcer Mayumi Yamano was found dead in the small town. Up until now, her whereabouts prior to her death had been unknown. But the police investigation has found that she had been staying in the region's famous Amagi Inn. She had apparently been staying there alone. Perhaps she was taking a vacation to recover from her ordeal? Oh yes, the Amagi Inn. Their hot springs are first rate. The manager's teenage okay. daughter also works there. And it's rumored that she'll take over the inn this spring. If that happens, she'll be one of the youngest managers on record. I should book another trip there. Uh, I see. Moving along, it's time for the weather report. The rain has begun to subside. From now until morning, heavy fog warnings will be in effect in the Inaba region. Visibility will be severely reduced, so please be careful if you plan on driving in the area. Hmm. Is the ramen ready now? Stupid little child. Give it some more time. <laughs> Are you sick? You're probably still adjusting to the new environment. Nanako, could you get him some cold medicine? 
Cold medicine. To fight colds. You should get to bed after you take it. Hmm. Can't still open the inventory. It's too bad. Ouch. I have to admit though, if, if, if she wouldn't have been dead or murdered, that looked kinda hot. But, oh, you're up. Well, I'm off. She got murdered. That's a different thing. Dad has to go do something. He got a call, so he left. I could call her Hanako from Kadava Shoujo. Uh, Dad has to um has to go to, uh, got to, has got uh, to go do something. God, fuck it! I have got to go do something. Hmm. When I looked, I saw three police cars zooming by. You live by the police station, don't you? Did you hear anything? I heard some yelling, but nothing more. A total disappointment. Jeez, you need to pay more attention to stuff like that. How else are we supposed to get the juicy stories? <laughs> Again? Well, we do know that Saki is kind of dead because we just saw her being dead. Hey, did you see it yesterday? Of course not. What is that rumor for real? I don't know, but it seems like a lot of people have seen it. <laughs> Yukiko said she'd be here after lunch. I wonder why they're holding a school assembly all of a sudden. Hey, what's wrong, Yosuke? Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. Everyone, please settle down. The school assembly mm -hmm. is about to begin. God, they look First, ugly. The principal has something to say. He looks like Mark Gandhi. I regret to say that I have a terrible announcement for all of you. One of our third-year students, Ms. Saki Kunishi of Class 3, has passed away. Oh, too bad. Passed away? Ms. Ouch. Kunishi was found deceased early this morning. The reasons behind her passing are currently under investigation by the police. If they ask you for your cooperation, I urge you, as students of this school, to provide only the facts. Well... Alright, please quiet down. I have been assured by the faculty that there's been no evidence that bullying was involved in the incident. So mind what you say, not only to the police, but to anyone who asks. Well... Found dead? How could this happen? <laughs> good mood rune. Because there's sure no good mood inside that anymore. <sighs> oh, what the fuck was that sound? What the hell? She died the same way as that announcer, right? It's so creepy. Well, last time it was from an antenna, but this time she was hanging from a telephone pole. A telephone pole? <laughs> like, they don't even have hobbies or such. God, I, I guess I eat it faster. I just burnt my fucking mouth with a sandwich, holy crap. It's gotta be a serial murder case. Okay. Someone said the cause of death was some unknown poison. Yeah, well, I got a safe. I just saved. 
saying that, uh, perhaps... Oh, by the way, did you hear? Someone saw a girl that looked like Saki on that Midnight Channel thingy. Well, basically, um... Saying Freps didn't work is a lie because it did, but... They said she totally looked like she was in pain. Isn't that scary? Just for your information, I know that there are some kind of weird uh, interferences, so it swapped because obviously the GPU uh, plugin of Freps can't... Uh, the codec can't handle the uh, plugins from a PXX emulator, and I use uh, a certain set of them. Because I know what I'm doing. I use the pretty open ones. Not the nodes, but the open ones. <laughs> Sounds like someone had a nightmare. The media's been broadcasting their interviews with her non-stop. So maybe they just had Saki on the brain. Sheesh. It's easy to toss around theories if you're not personally involved. In fact, yes. Hey. Did you guys check out the TV last night? Yosuke, not you too. Just listen for a sec. Something kept bothering me, so I watched it again, and I think the girl on the screen, Saki Senpai. There's no mistaking it. Senpai looked like she was writhing in pain. And then what the hell? Disappeared from the screen. Oh, so where was I? Oh, never mind. It wasn't anything special, was it? What? 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 In the butt? You heard Senpai's body was found in a similar situation as that announcer's, right? No. Remember that guy you told us about? How he was all excited that his soulmate was the announcer? Okay, so um just maybe, but Ms. Yamano might have been on that midnight channel before she died too. Yeah, what do you want to say? What's that supposed to mean? Hold on, are you saying people who appear on that TV die? Yeah, well that would be easy. I can't say for sure. But something tells me. I just can't dismiss it as coincidence. Uh, Plus, remember what that bear thing said? How that place was dangerous and we should leave before the fog clears? 